back, my friend. Always happy to be here. I'm thrilled to be here with our QVC customers. Today, we have, so it's our 10th anniversary, David. Yeah. And we brought a classic silicone set back. You're going to show exactly what those I pieces are. I just wanted are. to show that you're getting the multi set. We have one set, no choices. Just one. It's the most popular. And it's usual. always the most yeah. popular. So we thought, why, if we're going to bring one set in, let's bring in the most popular exactly. one. Exactly. So you get the large spurtle in red. This is covered in silicone. It has a nylon core, so it's very durable. And it's coated in silicone. So this is the red large spurtle, the slotted spurt, the, uh, the regular spurt, and the skinny spurt. What you should know is that all these can go in the dishwasher. Absolutely. Every single one of them. And you get all four of them for $19. Hey, good deal. Yeah, great deal. Now's the time to stock up. Now's the time to gift. Let's do a little Spurtle 101, David. Sure. First of all, they're beveled all the way around the outside here. So that means that you've got this spatula action, which, by the way, here's your garden variety spatula. Here's a Spurtle. Why am I wasting this whole area here that I can't use? Because if you look here at the pan, so here's your standard pan, the side, the bottom, and when you get that Spurtle in there, you are not missing one bit all the way over to the edge here. If you make custard or you make polenta or you make anything, you're getting right down in there. So that's why we made the spurtle. But let's talk about the history of the spurtle, my okay. friend. All right. So this was originally made in Scotland for stirring oatmeal. Now, they used a different, uh, you know, material back in the 1600s, 1500s. But you can see how you can get in there and turn this over. Imagine if you were mixing up some ziti with some sauce or any number of things, your mashed potatoes. And then unlike a spoon, it comes right off, but you can just go like this and you bring it right off. It's clean. So you're not like going like that to get it out. So that's the original. Now, the first two pieces we ever made was the original and the small. Now look at this. This is an avocado. It's hard to even imagine anything that would be eat. Look at that. We got every single bit out with, th with that, and that's the small, all right? Now, come over here. We're going to take a look at the slotted, which has, this is a little bit of an unsung hero. The first thing I always like to do is show how you can separate an egg with the slotted. I've done multiple, so I'm not going to do that right now. I discovered that. You remember when I discovered that? David, I was working in the test kitchen at Martha Stewart yep. and I had about 10 to do for an angel food cake. Anyway, now we've got the skinny. The skinny is just amazing because it goes down in the jars. You could pull out a few capers if you wanted to. You could get the very bottom of what's in the jar. That's something that like people love this for. But sometimes you just want to put a little butter in the pan mm -hmm. or butter your toast. The skinny becomes one of your most useful tools. So that's a little, you know, landscape around all of them. But then all of them do multiple things, David, because as you know, that's what Mad Hungry is all about. You're getting ready. Well, why don't we do that? Why don't we jump right in there because you're ready and you can take over. I just don't want your, um, your uh, butter to turn brown. So when you have the slotted, you don't need to grab a whisk. You can just whisk with your slotted. And that's what's beautiful because normally what you'd have to then go do is go get another tool right. in order to stir. I'm going to put this in right in the pan. And I'm going to just move on. To, and I'll tend to it. And you tend to it. And you can let that set. I, I'm just going to quickly show something, which Please, is just that course. this is a nonstick skillet that you don't want to ruin, right? And again, what I showed you is that you're going to have, you're going to be able to get right down in there where it, I, oh my gosh, I take such pleasure in this. This makes me really happy. <laughs> you don't miss any. You don't ruin your, spa, your, your uh, skillet. I'm going to let Thank David you. go there. And I'm going to come over here. <clears throat> uh, while you're making your eggs, and you can really see how that works. And again, it's beveled all the way around. So it's not only on the bottom, but all the way around. Now, David knows that I have a family that I cook for every day. You do. Peanut butter sandwiches with the boys. I mean, that's a schmear. And you've got three boys. I got three boys and a husband, and they are grown up, but they're always at the house. But when they were little, I made a ton of sandwiches. So this is something basic and simple, but you can see how you can just grab it and just get what you need. You don't have to go back and forth and back and forth. Do a schmear and you're good. So that's that, that's that one. Uh, again, this is the perfect little tool for icing a cupcake. If you have little ones in the kitchen that like to cook with you, maybe a grandchild, maybe your daughter, your son, and you give them one of these tools themselves, they feel really special, David. They just feel like they're the little chef in the kitchen, you know? Well, exactly, and I can tell you now that we've taken orders for 
600 sets are gone. These are very, very popular, and about 100 people are picking up more than one. Yes, because it's a great gift. Most people, even though we've sold so many here, David, but a lot of people still don't have spurtles. So when you go to your favorite cook and you bring a spurtle in, they don't know what it is. You tell them about it, and then they're going to tell you later, what is that thingy again? I use a spurtle every time I cook. Every day. I have them in the crock um, by my stove, and I use them every single time I cook. And let's turn out this omelet. Look at you. Oh, my goodness. Skills. Very fancy. Those Look at that. Those are skills. This is a couple of other fun things. Um, so one day when I was cooking some vegetables and I had the slotted spurtle nearby, I didn't want to grab a colander, right? Right. So I just hook this on the side of the pan. And look, it just gets all the liquid out. It will hold back the food if, come on, food, slide down. Well, if the food did slide down, it wouldn't fall out. And again, these are the handy things that you learn, David, as you know, when you cook all the time. That's the beauty of the spurtle is that I'm in that kitchen cooking. I write cookbooks. I'm doing things for television. Now, how about this one? This um, we have so much fun with because look, that is the size of the spaghetti squash. Now you said you've been eating a lot of spaghetti squash. I uh, right, low carb, yeah. And so this is simple, and this mimics pasta. It mimics so you pasta. can is... you can make spaghetti squash and make something really really special. And um, look, I've got this out just coming right out there. See, the whole thing just right out. And when you when you roast this in the oven, park it cut side down, on some parchment paper. And then just let the oven do the work for you. We get four spurtles in this pack up. There's the skinny spurt, the regular spurt, the slotted spurtle, and the large spurtle. All four of these, all covered in silicone. Most popular has always been the multi, so we yeah. brought it back as a single exactly. choice. Exactly. And this again is the slotted. Now I showed you that you can separate an egg. I'm going to show you one more time just so that you don't think that we were pulling any funny business on you. There you go. That's separating an egg with the slotted spurtle, which is unbelievable. We have the spaghetti squash here, which we have, I'm just gonna do one more side so you can see that you can get right in there and you just get every little bit. I just love that about it. Well, and you know what? Food is too expensive to waste. So I, you wanna oh, take advantage of every I little am, bit. I am the original frugal fanny when it comes to cooking. We have the large one here to use for folding. Now, as you know, David, folding is a technique where you wanna keep all the air. So with all this surface area here, unlike that spatula that mm -hmm. only gave me this much, I can both fold and fold over, but I can also kind of squeegee the side as I'm going. Think about how many times you're in your standing mixer. This goes right under the paddle on your standing mixer. See? So it we smells have amazing. and yeah. every single tool does multiple things. Let's well, do a let me tell smear. you that already we have taken orders for 1200 of these are gone. I should also tell you it breaks down to less than $5 per tool at this price and the five easy payments of only three dollars and eighty cents makes this super affordable everything's on five pay today on air and online until end of day today so don't miss out on this opportunity we're super excited to be able to bring you a four piece spurtle set skinny spurt regular spurt slotted spurt and large spurtle all four pieces for nineteen dollars and five easy payments of not just three dollars and eighty cents this is a remarkable thing how about tuna salad because we're oh my goodness i forgot i was because looking we're scooping we're scraping yes we're that's smashing. one of my favorite things to do so we have our our vegetables that we cut up here so it was like i, I forget I, I i get it wrong sometimes but it's a bunch of asses so mm. i scrape into the bowl here and i'll give you that Thank my dear you. and then you can scoop with just one scoop I make this at least once a week, and every time I do it, then you can smash. Every time I do it, I think I wish people could see that I really do this all the time. And you're smashing because a lot of the time the tuna is chunky, so you need to smash it. And you stir it. <clears throat> and let's see. Yeah, we do it. Do we have a piece of bread left? I'm not sure. But mm. as you can see, we can then serve. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, there you go. You found one. There is a little cup of water underneath. So I, what did I do? I, I, I scooped, I scraped, I smashed, I stirred, and now I'm going to serve. One little tool, You're David. Spread. Sp spread and serve. Spread and serve. Spread and serve. So that's a lot of S's, and that's a lot of actions for one little tool, which I think is pretty terrific. And that's what we do at Mad Hungry. We make things that have multiple uses in your kitchen. This is an extraordinary set of spurtles, one of our most popular sets, and at a really phenomenal price. All four pieces for $19 and five easy payments of $3.80. 1,800 sets are now gone, and many of you are buying more than one set. 
These make great gift ideas if you've got a second home or if you just have extra cooks in the kitchen, you'll need extra spurtles. Yes, and these all go into the dishwasher quick, easy peasy, no problem, no concern because they're all coated in silicone. Yep. Don't miss out on this. And 2,000 sets are now gone. 500 people are picking up more than one set, so smart. and they're going very, very quickly. If you have not yet followed Lucinda Scala Quinn on Instagram at, at Mad Hungry, yes, you at should, Mad Hungry. Thank you, darling. Because her Insta stories are legendary. She is the queen of cooking with one hand <laughs> uh, and holding the camera with the other. Um, I I love to pile up in bed and just watch your stories. They're fantastic. Oh my dear, that makes me happy. They are fantastic. I love watching you cook. I love it when you toast seeds in that little skillet. Oh yeah. Um, the really seed fantastic. Toaster. I know, right? So this is K83557. Stay on the line here. LSQ, it's good to have you back, my friend. Thank you. Lovely to see you this Sunday. Nice to have you back with us. All right. Wednesday, we've got not a kitchen show, but a three-hour gardening show. It's going to be all things garden.